Good morning and welcome to SUNUP. I'm Dave Deacon. Stockers are a large part of the cattle industry in Oklahoma. And SUNUP's Curtis Hare takes us to the Marvin Clemmy Research Station near Bessie to show us what OSU researchers are looking into to maintain a little bit of stability in changing times. So these cattle started in the middle of May looking at uh, performance of these cattle uh, throughout the summer on, on these r rolling red shale hills. It's nearing the end of the second year of stalker cattle research at the Clemmy Research Station in Washita County. Today is weighing day. OSU Extension Livestock Specialist Paul Beck is leading the study and researchers are testing a management practice for stocking rates. So our goal with this is to be able to increase stocking rate with this research. Uh, we have a set stocking rate of six acres per steer for the summer for our normal stocking rate. Uh, our goal was to increase stocking rate by one third by feeding three and a half to four pounds of uh, this range cube supplement per day, trying to, to look at how we can intensify production increasing stocking rates without decreasing range condition. For this research, OSU partnered with a local producer to graze his cattle on about 600 acres of the university's land. Working with collaborators to supply cattle uh, is a win-win for both OSU and, and the people we're working with. While the project is only on year two, the results so far have been surprising. It surprised us last year that we were able to both increase stocking rate and increase average daily gain with this treatment. Normally, when we increase stocking rate, we're going to decrease average daily gain. And so our goal was to keep average daily gain about the same, uh, along with that increase in stocking rate. So having an increase in gain, along with that increase in stocking rate, is very impressive and very economically powerful. Increasing stocking rates while maintaining rangeland stability is the purpose of the study but the bigger picture is to help fortify the stalker cattle business. Our overall goal is to improve the economic resilience of our stalker cattle enterprise. In, in agriculture, the, we've got some things working against us as far as uh, increased land costs and cost of production and a, a, you know, an increasing age of average age of our producers. So to, to get young people more involved in agriculture to get them back on the farm or into production agriculture. It needs to be economically sustainable for them. Stalker cattle are a good way for young producers to get involved in agriculture and to build equity in a farming operation by adding value to cattle that are weaned but not ready to go to the feed yard. Paul and his team are conducting similar research across the state and will continue studies here at Clemmy next summer. In Washita County, I'm Curtis Hare.